welcome to my channel everyone um so yeah so today i'm going to be doing this look actually i got on pinterest and i like looked up like eyeshadow looks and this girl had done this like yellow and orange uh look and i just i loved it and i was so inspired so i did it myself um you'll see all the products that i use in the video um i'm super excited i'm so excited to be back on youtube it's been so long and just thank y'all so much for everything and I think I'm gonna do a get ready with me soon um, just leave some comments down below if you want to do a get ready with me and just like so y'all can know about me and my life and just catch up with me um, so yeah so welcome to my channel thank y'all for tuning in today and let's get started with the video uh, 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 uh. okay and I really don't know what's going on with my hair I just kind of like took a thin like lower vein and like pushed it back so that's just kind of what's going on right now but I've been going natural for like a really long time so yeah so okay so first thing I'm gonna go in with is like, both my facial spray that includes aloe cucumber and green tea um, okay so I'm gonna go in with my fit me dewy and smooth um, I am in color 24 and golden beige like eight dollars at Ulta roughly um, it's great. I love it. And so I'm just going to put this on the back of my hand. I got this beauty blender. It is like shit wall. It's damn. And so I soaked it and like squeezed the crap out of it. And um, so yeah, and I just got this from the beauty supply store. I think it's Kiss. I think the brand. Okay, so now that that's all over my face, I'm going to dab it out with the flat side of the beauty blender. Um, I love beauty blenders. Like love them and um so i picked up this uh makeup revolution chocolate vice palette Too Faced actually just came out with a like palette extremely similar to, similar to this um but this came out first like this is the og i've had this since like christmas my mom bought it for me so i love the mirror in this palette you see how like big it is yeah, so you're just gonna like press that into the skin and you really want to make sure this helps kind of hold it up, I'm gonna lie to you. I'm gonna go over my eye. Wow. Okay, so next I'm gonna go in with my tarp, tarp, <laughs> my tart shape tape. Um, I am in color light neutral. Um, and so mine's actually extremely light. Like I went way lighter than my, uh, they say your concealer should be like one shade lighter than your like foundation. But I went way lighter, but I like it. I'm just gonna dab that. Cause a little bit goes a long way. I'm sure y'all know that. Um, but you don't need that much. But yep, I highlight my teeth on. And then I'm gonna take the other side of that beauty blender, not the flat side, the pointed side. And I'm gonna like just blend this in, baby. Great, so now that that's all like blended in, yeah, 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 it's my favorite part. Okay, so I'm gonna go in with this. Um, I use the Airspun Loose Face Powder. Uh, this is a drugstore brand and it is amazing. This stuff I love, I could bake all day at 420 degrees, baby. Full life, yes, all day. But I'm gonna bake my whole face just because I do get kind of oily, and I did use the dewy foundation, and so like just to like pat myself out everywhere, and I'm gonna pay close attention to my under eyes because I'm about to go in with my eyeshadow, and I don't want that fall out. So going back in with my Tarte Shape Tape, um, I'm gonna use this as eyelid pri as eyeshadow primer. That's the eyelid primer. Do a couple dots and then I'm just gonna go back in my beauty blender that same side that I used to blend out my face and just blend it out on my eyes okay so my eyes are done so now let me go ahead and just do my eyebrows real quick because that's kind of a process in itself um, but I'm not gonna leave y'all out on the product that I am using. So I am using the Cabral Benefit. I am in shade five. Um, my friend C is a four, and I've like used theirs before, 
and it looks perfectly fine. But I don't know. I like the darker shade on my eye sh on my eyebrows. I'm gonna say eyeshadow on my eyebrows, and so I'm gonna go ahead and just go on with this, and I'll be right back. Okay, so my eyebrows are done. Um, so now I'm gonna go in with like a cream shade to just kind of matte out my eye to make it also easier to blend eyeshadow on it. Um, and so I'm gonna go in with my um, chocolate vice palette. I keep forgetting what the name of this is. And I'm going with this shade right here. And I'm just gonna rub that all over my eyelid just to make it easier. I'm gonna go in with my Eco Tools um, eyeshadow brush. This is the blend side. Perfect. And so now, okay, so I finally decided that I'm going to do a like orange and yellow look. I'm going to work in this bottom corner right here. Um, and it's going to be so cute. Y'all, it's going to be so cute. I just, I saw a picture. I was inspired and I was like, I know what I'm going to do. So let's get started with the eyes. Okay, so I'm going to go back in with the Eco Tools blend uh, side of the brush. And I'm going to go ahead and I'm just going to uh, dip into, it's going to be this yellow in the corner, in the bottom corner right here. So I'm just going to go ahead and dip into that yellow. And I'm going to work that all towards the top of my eyelid. Okay, so now that I have that yellow blended out on my eye, I'm going to go ahead and go in with, with this orange right here, this softer orange on the Morphe uh, palette. And I'm just going to work that in on the inside of that um, yellow right here and kind of blend that out. Um, I am going to go in with the Sonia Kashunk. So, I don't know, but I got it from Target. Um, this is her little eye, eye set that I bought. It was on sale for $6, originally like an $18 like, set of brushes. And so, it just came with like four brushes, um, four or five brushes. And this is one of them, so I'm just going to go ahead and use this to blend that orange um, on the inside of this yellow. Not gonna lie, these are kind of rough on the eyelid. Um. Okay, so next I'm gonna go in with this like deep, dark, I don't know, it's not dark, but you know what I mean. It's just, it's a deep orange, it's kind of fiery. Um, the v video does not give it justice at all. It's so pretty. Um, and so I'm gonna go ahead and go in with this color. And so I'm gonna do this on the inside of the lid right here. And I'm going with this pesky little, ugh, that everyone hates. But I think they like, I personally think they transform the color very well from the palette to your eyelid. And so I'm just gonna go ahead and like get that wet. I'm gonna go in and touch this uh, orange. And I'm gonna apply it to my eyelid. Okay, perfect, so the orange is applied, so I'm just gonna go back in and dip into that yellow that I had earlier um, in the bottom corner right here. I'm gonna dip into it and kind of work down the outside and work on the inside of my eye too right here. So I'm gonna go ahead and go in with my finger and just dip into this like shiny yellow right here. See that right there? And so I'm gonna go ahead and dip into it and just touch it on the inside of my eye to kind of brighten it. Okay, perfect. So now I'm gonna go in with my mascara. Um, today I'm gonna go in with my Wet n Wild Mega Wear mascara and this Ulta Fabulous Fiber. Um, I do have falsies. I have wispies. Yes, my dog chewed them up. But I've only worn them once, so I'm gonna put them on for y'all today. And so yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead and just like give myself a base coat on my eyelashes. Uh, you don't wanna do too much, it just helps cause like there was a lot of color and a lot of fallout from that eyeshadow. And so this will just help like the uh, fake eyelashes blend. So that's done. So now I'm gonna go ahead and grab my eyelashes. I'm gonna go ahead and apply these and I'll be right back. Okay, perfect. So now that my fake lashes are on, I'm gonna go ahead and dust away using one of my Sonia brushes, um, the uh, baking powder underneath my eye, and all over my face. Okay, perfect. And I'm gonna go ahead and get this um, 
Eco Tools brush, and I'm gonna take the side that says smudge, and I'm that's literally what I'm about to do. I'm about to smudge that um, yellow underneath my eye that I used before. So now that I have that smudged out on my under eye, I'm gonna go ahead and apply mascara down there. I'm gonna go in with my Wet n Wild Mega Wear mascara. This stuff is super cheap, and I really like it because it doesn't like. Stay, I mean, it'll stay on your eyes and it'll look good, but it'll stay natural and it'll look really nice. So it doesn't clump up or get too nasty or anything. And so that's why I really like this eyeliner, huh? This is why I really like this mascara because like, it just, it wears very nice. Okay, perfect. Now that my eyes are done. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and finish the rest of my face. Um, and so the first thing that I'm gonna go in with is gonna be concealer, I mean, concealer the first thing I'm gonna go in with is gonna be con contour dang and so for contour today I'm gonna be using this makeup revolution um, the one solution sculpt uh, contour stick and so I'm gonna go in and see what I'm gonna do I'm gonna sculpt I'm gonna sculpt my cheekbones out and this is actually a cream um, contour and honestly I'm a huge fan it blends out so easy and it's so easy to work with on your skin that there. I'm gonna go in with this Artiste brush and go ahead and just blend it out okay and so now I have that all blended out and see like you can barely tell it's there um and so since that's the case I'm gonna go ahead and work in this palette that my grandma got me for Christmas is right in front of my face I'm like looking everywhere um and it's from it's by Ulta and it comes with this many eyeshadows and then it has another side that comes with like a highlighter, a blush, and then also you can see this is like a contour color. And I use it and it's like really matte and I really like it. And so I'm gonna go ahead and go in with this angled brush that I have right here, this angled fluffy brush. And I'm just gonna go ahead and like blend that into my face. I'm gonna use this contour and put it like on top of that cream just cause it's kind of soft and you can't really see it. And so this will help just like kind of define that contour. I'm going to go in and put that all over my face. Beautiful. Okay. And now, since I just did that, I'm going to go ahead and go in with this pl blush. <laughs> this blush right here in this palette that my grandma gave me. Um, right here in the top corner. And so I'm just going to dip into it. It's kind of a peachy, less pinky, and I really like that about it. And so I'm going to go ahead and apply it to the apple of my cheeks with that same angled brush that I used for my contour. Girl, so cute. Okay, so now that that is done, I'm gonna go ahead and apply some highlighter. Um, I'm gonna be using a NYX Golden Highlighter. Um, it's so old, I couldn't even tell you if they still produce it or not, but I love it. It's absolutely my favorite stuff ever, 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 ever. And so I'm gonna go ahead and just apply this. I usually apply with my finger just because it gives me like a better like applicator than anything else. The, the color payoff is a lot better um, than if I try to use like a brush or something. But I'm gonna go ahead and just go in with that uh, highlighter. It's a gold color, so it's like super pretty on my skin. Um, and so I'm just gonna go ahead and apply that. Touch that on my nose. Touch that on my nose. Skin, skin. baby so pretty okay so with that same highlighter i'm gonna go in and just touch it up onto my brow bone too to kind of give it that pop um and i'm gonna go in with that little stinking ugly applicator but again like i like the color payoff so i'm gonna use it anyway and so i'm just gonna touch it on the top of my eyebrow right there Okay, so now I'm gonna move on to my lips. It's gonna be the last part of my tutorial. Usually I don't even put on lips, but I'm gonna do it today. So I'm gonna go in with one of these NYX uh, Soft Matte Lip Creams. This color is London. Um, it's a beautiful nude. And so I'm gonna go ahead and just apply it on my lips. Awesome, so my lips are done. 
and this is the completed look y'all and so as you can see i kind of went with like an orange yellow kind of tonish um feel and yeah this is just like an everyday look i will wear this every day honestly like because that's just me um but yes and so thanks y'all for tuning into my channel i hope you liked my playlist do, 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 do. and yeah and so just thank y'all so much for tuning in today and this is the completed look I got my rings, if you wanna please me, send me the pussy, I'm gonna